Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Warning, the following video is a parody. So don't take it too seriously. I know there's some frauditors out there that might think that these two are making fun of them. And yeah, they're right. They are making fun of you guys. So thank you to Highway Star and uh, Little Chihuahua Big World, uh, big supporters of the channel, who created this parody. And I will leave the link in the description box below to the original uncut, unedited video, while I will be inserting my commentary in this video. And yes, I know it's a parody, so don't act like I'm a complete moron because I already know. And that's just a message to the frauditors who have really no t uh, basis in reality for anything they say. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Hello everybody, Little G here with a tiny bit of fun. I got a good thing for y'all today. Guess what I found? I found the world's oldest frauditor. And here he is, ladies and gentlemen, the world's oldest frauditor. Hello, sir. Can I, oh. can I get you the, hey, hi, can I get your name? Uh, I don't answer questions. Are you stupid or something? Oh, you don't answer questions. Is that what you told your teachers when you were back in uh, high school? Uh, I, I don't answer questions on tests. And I suppose that's the reason why you failed high school, too. Because, well, if you don't answer questions on tests, then you don't pass the test. You don't pass high school. And then you become a huge failure in life and have to become a First Amendment auditor where you still don't answer questions for anybody. Oh... Uh now, sir, you're not in the in the uh, in the, in the frauditing community anymore. Oh, oh, uh, you can just call me good citizen. Good citizen, huh? Now, isn't that a bit of a misnomer, considering that the majority of you frauditors are nothing but a bunch of uh, criminal scumbags, anyway? I mean. Uh, you're not exactly good citizens now, are you, with those lengthy criminal records? In fact, I wonder what your criminal record looks like. And how old are you? Well, let's see here. This question I will answer. Okay. Since, since you asked. Okay. For someone who, who was a frauditor, you sure do answer questions. That's auditor. Uh, okay. Well, I can't remember my age. Let's just say I'm older than dirt. You're older than dirt, huh? I'm older than the dirt itself. Okay. Well, what do you think about these frauditors nowadays? Well, by the way, they're not frauditors. We're auditors. <laughs> okay, 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 good citizen. We're, we're auditors. Oh, Mr. Good Citizen Frauditor, are you butthurt that you were called a frauditor by your interviewer? Oh, my goodness, dude. Maybe you should go home and cry in your little pillow tonight at the nursing home. Or better yet, I've got a case of, uh... B Black Heart Knight's Butt Hurt Cream. Guaranteed to cure any pain in your ass. No guarantees at all, though. So just go ahead and uh, have your nurse apply some to your uh, rear end tonight. That way, well, you can fall asleep knowing that you won't feel any pain. Or, well, you're not supposed to anyway. At least not in your ass afterwards. So let's continue on, shall we? Okay, so... What do you think about these auditors now? These auditors now, they're crap. They are, huh? They're crap. They've gotten plumb away from the narrative. They've gotten plumb away from the script. 
Well, can I interject something, good citizen? I think I think they've overwrote the script because they're going into public now and filming everybody. You know what? You're right. You're right. They've gotten away from the real purpose. Which was? Which was. See, when I was in the game... Oh, let's get, I'm sorry, I'm getting a little bit sleepy here. <laughs> that's that's when okay. When I was in the game, it was all about accountability and transparency of our government officials, you know, police departments, post yeah. offices, courthouses. That's what it was all about. Well, still, Frauditor, I'm sure you heard of the public forum doctrine of uh, uh, traditional public forums, non-public forums, limited public forums, and everything like that. I'm sure it must have been told to you at some point in your pathetic auditing career, such as by a judge in one of your many, many courtroom hearings. I mean, come on now, dude. you got to know that this stuff exists. Well, now I think you, um, the Friday's, oops, I'm sorry, auditors, they re, they put poster seven to mean something different. Mm, well, how do you mean by different? Well, in other words, they, they don't look at the part where it says, except when told to, well, well, basically told to leave by the heads of the uh, facility. Well, we're the ones who had the camera. We're the ones who had all the rights. Ah, good, yes. Another frauditor finally admits that uh, it's the uh, camera that gives them the extra rights that they think they have. Oh, boy. So you do realize that the First Amendment, uh, that freedom of the press doesn't grant you any special rights or privileges. It just means that you can publish your stories without interference from the government. I mean, that kind of thing. I mean, you still can be trespassed from uh, public places no matter what, even if you haven't committed a crime. But you know how a frauditor's brain works. I mean, the moment they leave a... Uh, place after being trespassed they forget all about being trespassed and go try it again at another place because well they their brain like i said just doesn't function very well on a deeper level okay when well, you what go about into a post office the first thing you look for is poster seven and it says right there in black and white okay photos photographs of hallways, corridors, four years may be taken. Yeah, but That's you have it. to. Yeah, but you have to have permission. We do have permission. You know what it is. By, by who? Know, by who? Not by who. By what? It's called the First Amendment. The Constitution that gave us all the right in the world. Okay, well, what is your most memorable fraud? I, I'm sorry, audit. What was your most successful audit? There have been so many, and I can't even remember. And how many times have you been arrested? Good Lord. You would bring that up. That's just like me trying to remember my age. I can't remember how many times I got arrested. Yeah. And the courts always went with them instead of me. Oh, but baby. I don't understand. Yeah, but now the auditors, they're going with the auditors now instead of against them. What, how do you feel about that? Do you think hey, that's right? That's good. Yeah, because... They're actually favoring the auditors? Now? Well, yeah, because the cops come up 
and and if the, the cops are calling them, they side with the with the fraud. I mean, the, I'm sorry, I'm so used to calling you guys the frauditors because of this. They're siding with the auditors instead of doing their actual jobs. How do you feel about that? Yay! It's about time. Okay. Hold on. Yeah, where is your mug say? Oh, you like that? I like that. It's got a hashtag on it. R A S H. I don't know what that means, but coffee sure tastes good coming. Well, I well I have one just like it, and it means rise and shine with Hezekiah, who's an anti frauditor anti frauditor Yes, that's what that, that's what that means. Rise and shine with Hezekiah. I have one just like it. Is he pretty popular? Yeah, he's he's fairly popular. I need to check him out then. Where can I find him? His channel name is Frauditor Follies. Frauditor Follies. Oh, is he on YouTube? Yes, he's on YouTube. Uh, I have to check him out. Yeah, he make well. You might not like him though, because he makes fun of the frauditors. I don't care. I don't care what they say. We were the best there was. Well, okay. One, if you could give these auditors nowadays a word of advice, what would it be? Don't wind up in here. And I'll tell you why. What? Oh, okay. Because they're going to make you keep your face clean shaven. They're going to make sure you have a bath every day. Say what? You can't go around looking any way you want to now. You know what they did to me? What did they do? They to even you? brought in a dentist. And he yanked out the only two teeth I had left. Well, they probably had the poem because they weren't taken care of. I don't care. It suited me just fine. Yeah, so, but... anyway, they pulled out my last two remaining teeth. They were pretty yellow, too. They were oh, no. Pretty yellow. Oh, yeah. Sir, oh, did you yeah, say pretty the... in yellow? Yeah, made the women go nuts. Okay. But now, look at me now. Oh, yeah, that's a nice set of teeth thing you got there. Yeah, I hate them. I hate them. Why do you hate them? Because frauditors were supposed to look like that. that okay, now, now I got to stop you right there. You called yourself a frauditor. Oh, oh excuse <laughs> me. Yeah, will you? Yeah, you messed up there for a minute there. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> yeah, sorry, so, young lady. And, uh, that's okay. Let's see. What else? Were there? I was thinking of something else. Oh, you oh, were? Look at my shoes. Now I have to wear shoes that ain't got shoelaces on. You know, we frauditors, in order to look the part, our shoes had to be untied. And so why was that? that? Could, so that we could trip over our own feet. Uh huh. It was all part of our image back in the day. Oh, okay. Okay. So what was your channel name? <sighs> that I can't remember. You can't, huh? It's been so long ago. Ah. I know I was popular. So I had, I had about uh, 10 subs. And whenever I would go live, all 10 subs would be watching. No, really? But, I, but you know what I would do? I would tell the person that I was focused on, you better tell me the truth. Like, you got 3,000 people watching you right now. With only 10 subs, how could you have 3,000 watching? <laughs> it was all up in Oh, oh, so in your mind just... you had 3,000 watching. Yeah. That sounds about right. In fact, it almost sounds like how dumbass Elmo operates. He'll uh, uh, film a video and say he's got thousands of people watching at that particular point in time 
when he isn't even doing a live stream. I mean, good grief, that dude lies all the freaking time. And view count, uh, yeah, he, uh, spouts off his view count like, uh, well, it's supposed to mean something. And I bet you half of those views are of people who are just flat out making fun of that dumbass. Who are they to tell me different? Oh, uh, really? Okay. So... So your advice to these new guys out there doing this for the first time, don't get arrested and stick to the script, huh? Because that, that's basically all y'all follow is a script. Remember, people, these are just like muscles. Rights are just like muscles. If you don't use them, you're going to lose them. Oh. Just like oh, See, are you control. okay? Yeah, yeah, I just can't even hold my cane up straight anymore. Oh, uh, so you really so, couldn't do a audit anymore? No. Uh, but remember, your rights are just like muscles. If you don't use them, you're going to lose them. Well, that's not always the case, but we can continue this discussion another time. Maybe you can come back over here again and we can continue this discussion. Yeah, we'll see. Okay, if well, I can, if I can stay awake long enough. <laughs> oh, and don't forget, people, there's no expectation of privacy in public. Yes, there Always is, but please remember that. Yes, but we can discuss that at a later time. Uh, I need to get this video kind of wrapped up, and so we'll just continue this discussion later. Okay, okay, now, can I take that now? Yes, you can. Oh. Okay. Okay, this is the end of the video. We just wanted to kind of let you know this was a parody, that no no people were harmed in the process of this video. And Highway Star, you did an excellent job at living. And any similarity to persons living or, died or dead is purely coincidental. Yes, so anyway, there's going to be a part two. We've already figured that out. So anyway, we hope y'all enjoy the little video. I know I enjoyed thinking up the script along with Highway Star. And again, if you haven't subscribed, like, share, and subscribe. Get it out there. Get the algorithm going. And we will see you on the next one. Little Chi for a tiny bit of fun. Out. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?